Hello everyone, welcome to a continuation of my playthrough of Dune 2 uh, for the Amiga. Uh, we're playing Household Dose and as you can see I'm trying my best to annoy our mentor but he's, he's not giving in. Uh, we're just about to take on the sixth mission in, um, in our quest for domination of the planet of Arrakis. And, um, and yeah, I just want to introduce briefly what this is going to be. Uh, at the time of recording, it is December 2023. Um, and I, um, I kind of need to take a bit of a break from video production, really, to, to get a few things done. But what I was hoping to do is record this um, in as as raw a fashion, as polished a raw a fashion as I can manage. So in the way that I would broadcast a live stream, uh, but put this out as a let's play video. I don't know exactly how long this will be or what point it will get to, but we'll we'll just give it a go and see. Um, I'm, I might end up doing multiple episodes, but what I'm hoping is this will provide some entertainment to you all um, throughout December. Uh, while other things are going on. So not part of a, a regularly scheduled series, but a continuation of this um, by now uh, long-running uh, attempt to get through all of this game. Uh, <laughs> it's just too easy to wind up. Okay, let's remind ourselves what we were supposed to be doing in this mission, because I have forgotten. Um, I think this will take a moment to load. Here we go. The Atreides have become far too vocal in the sector, and whine constantly about their rights. Oh, I, I see. I, I, I'm getting the alignment of uh, House Ordos down now, I think. We Ordos do not have the leisure of pointless conversation, and must ask that you eliminate this distraction. Okay, is that is that it? Yep. Yeah. Yeah, that's it. Okay, well, let's get on with the mission then. So we're at our starting point. So just find and destroy any sign of the Atreides um, with no extra special... I think he's having a nap. Uh, no extra special conditions to take into account. So what I'm going to do first of all, I, uh, I mean, this seems perfectly fine and sensible to me. Yes, I guess it might seem a little cheaty to some people, but uh, this is just going to be a dummy run. So I'm going to send uh, what vehicles we have into, uh, say, the first, uh, the first, the four corners of this map as a good way of trying to expose perhaps where the, oh, hang on, did I not send the right, uh... oh, no, you, I sent you the wrong way, sorry. Um, trying to work out where the Atreides would be on this map. But if we can get some intel, like... Uh, okay, well, we seem to have encountered some... Okay, there's up here. I thought that would be the most likely, as that's the vehicle we got the first. Right, so they're over in this corner. While this is going on, can I build... Let's upgrade this. Let's just see if I can build... Oh, worm sign. So I think somebody might have eaten one of my vehicles. Let's see if we can build a radar station so that we can, and oh, we need to, okay, we need a power sent first, that makes sense. Um, so we can just get like a, a more of a view of what's going on. Building's fast, isn't it? I'd forgotten how fast it is. That's exciting. Okay. Um, yes, so that's a spice for me, that's nice, but we want the raid outpost for detection purposes at the moment. Oh no, actually we don't, uh, we can't play, well I guess we could place that on rocky ground because we're not, we're not building anything to last here are we? Oh, that sounded like an a hang angry worm again. Right, here we go. Okay, so that one, I think, got eaten by a worm, but there's lots of spice there. And then this one's over here. And there's a one, that one got eaten by a worm as well. We're not doing too well. But we know the Atreides are up here with pretty extensive fortified base. 
which is interesting. They seem to have some good turrets and some extra hard tanks, which, I mean, I can only hope that we're going to get something along those lines. Yes, right, we didn't, we really didn't get, in, no, don't get, don't get wormed. Okay, this would be a lot of worm activity on this map. I'm not enjoying that. Base is under attack, okay. Um, let's see if I can get you over there because that seems like a big area that we haven't explored yet. Yeah, so yes, it's not a good idea to. So we probably don't want to go too far north of the midline, really, uh, for fear of it attracting their attention. Oh, you guys can attack that. And you can attack that. It might buy us a little bit of time, I suppose. Right, how's this one doing? Is it getting eaten by a worm? Yeah. Um, I suppose it's good to notice there are a couple of good patches in the southerly portion here. So we might, if we, if the south is clear. Oh, okay. What? Oh, what's this? That seems to be a bit. Oh, oh, two bases. That's where, that's where our escalation. Three bases? What? Like one extensive base? Oh my goodness. Okay. Uh, right. Well, that makes sense, I suppose. Um, can you get to the middle at all? Just so that we can see a bit more. Okay. So, yeah. Kind of. We want to stick to south of our base, really, if we can, because I think that's quite an extensive base there. Probably the more extensive of the two, the little we've seen so far. Okay. Hmm. I'm going to have to try and remember all the all the things we can build and do. But, um... Uh, so we can put it in operation. There seems to be quite a, a healthy amount of spice in the, um... In the middle between these two Atreides outposts, which makes sense. Yes, sir. Uh, okay, you're not going to survive for very long. Let's just see if you can cut down the center a little bit so that. Oh gosh, there's loads of them here. Okay, I think this is a fairly. I mean, I'm hoping there isn't a third base, for goodness sake. Um, that, I think that gives us a good idea of what we'll be facing when we start getting earnest in a minute. Um, okay, ooh! Yeah, I mean three, they do look quite, what are those? They're siege tanks, those ones with the chunky, chunky cannons on top. That's a quad. Well, let's hope we can get some siege tanks. Yeah, so that's just straight sand, really, that bit. Okay. All right, well, let's conclude this little, little story time by having, thanks, uh, this one, uh, bravely attack this siege tank and then promptly get blown up. Because that'll be fun. Yeah, there we go. Oh, there's one, oh, there's one brave soldier. Go little soldier. What? But I've got one soldier left. Okay, I'll try again. Um, right, so I can. Should be able to restart them. Oh, do you instruct your troops to fire randomly into the air? I, I mean, I do. Should I not be? Is there any plan to your idiotic maneuvers? Um, well, this was reconnaissance, you know, because I've got save and restore functions. I suggest that you no longer allow your dog assist in managing your assignments. Oh, hang on, what did I click there? Oh yes, because you can, you can fail forward, I think, can't you? Oh, proceed. I don't know if you can, I don't know to what extent you can fail and yeah, that's interesting, isn't it? So, 
So I'm assuming the blue area would get better, bigger. No, it didn't really. Interesting. Uh, right, well this is confusing because I just want to go and restore the th to the a previous thing. But let's say that one. All right, well ignore any of this. This is just, yeah. This is like an, uh, a spice-induced fever dream that may perhaps presage what would happen in the future with extended loading times. But actually, we're just going to go back and do that mission again until we get it right because that that seems to be the more rewarding way to do it than just blow up. I don't think you can just keep blowing up every time and get anywhere. I mean, it'd be interesting if you could. Oh, this is the same. Oh, maybe if you fail it, then you just get like a similar mission in a different area. I don't know. But I'm, I'm assuming, I don't know what, I don't know if I had the same selection of maps as last time. I don't know if I accidentally picked the same one. But I'm assuming this would be a different map. Uh, yeah, it looks like a different configuration, doesn't it? So, hopefully, what I can actually do is load a game. There we go. All right, we're just gonna we're gonna take it easy. We're gonna have a chill, a chill time conquering a planet. We're gonna dial it down. Relax with me, as we. Um, are subjected to the consistent sound of uh, bombardment by heavy gunfire. It'll be relaxing. And you know, there's a, there's a nice meditative pause during the loading times where there's a chance to be aware of ourselves in our, in our place in the universe. continuum of energy and matter in which we are all connected there we go we're, yay we're back okay so um, what would I yes, sir. Well, let's have let's station these yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. north of Acknowledge. the construction yard We've got 1,700, which doesn't seem like a lot, so we want to get um, mining, yes, really. Right, let's start getting some... So what can I build without upgrading? Oh, uh, right, I see. Uh... Yeah, let's get the advanced slab technology unlocked, which is the ability to make four slabs at once. Um, there. And then... Right, we can go there, I think. Okay, so we want to get one of these before anything else can um, be achieved. I feel like the um, uh, what was I going to say? I feel like the construction of a construction radar thing would be useful. So we'll do that. Um, but can we get a spice spice finally? Let's get that going first. I want to get the, the spice flowing because that's that's the mantra, you know. Right, 
Right, you. Oh. Yes, sir. I'm going to move you down to this corner here. No, down here, please. Thank you. Um, right, how are we doing energy level wise? Need to. Okay, we're doing fine. Um, let's see. Actually, let's have a little exploration. You guys can move down here, can't you? Right, where's the. It's down here. Um, right, so if you harvest. I'm going to click on you, and then you can harvest there. You know what? A very kind um, viewer in one of my streams did tell me. Oh, actually, you can harvest there. That's closer to where you are. Um, the keyboard shortcut for doing these things and I have totally forgotten them but I could could go back and look them up again um, I do get um, kind of caught up with uh, just mouse controls so as long as I can make it work for me I think I think it'll be all right uh, right let's put the radar down there maybe so we want to build more slabs another f oh starport facility well that's a new thing i don't know what that will get us but oh does that mean we can export our spice that would be interesting oh oh so many options okay well um i i got a little bit distracted and excited about that but let's get the radar going Construction. And radar is that one? There we go. Be mindful of credits as well, I suppose. Construction complete. What defences can we get as well? Because we had walls and all sorts of things before. Yes, sir. Oh, okay, now we can see a lot more. That's good. Um, right, so this area actually is, is good for paving on, isn't it? Yeah, this is this is nice. Okay, so if we had a starport somehow, that would be cool. Um, Let's build. Okay, ah, now we've got some stuff. Um, or a rocket turret. I think that's what we might have seen the Atreides with. And the regular cannon turret. So, is that. I'd assume that goes to further range. Um, infantry barracks. Possibly useful, though I've, I still haven't found a really good useful for. a really good use for infantry yet. Um. Uh, I still need to work out how to uh, infiltrate enemy buildings uh, as a possibility as well. Okay, uh, so uh, I think a lot of these things I'd have to upgrade things for. Oh no, but the upgrade thing is there in... hmm, interesting. But that one I definitely would need to. Interesting. Um, I mean, walls are good, turrets are good, so we can get some of that going. And then we've got light vehicle factory, spice storage silo, radar outpost. So if we're building stuff up, probably more power, storage, more spice harvesting first, I think, uh, before we get carried away with all the exciting things that we can do. So let's build this. And just hope no tradies find us anytime soon. Alright, let's have that there. And then build another one. Thanks. Construction complete. And place it. Let's just check how our little harvest is doing. Yes sir. It is seventy percent full, that's fine. We keep going. Um, right, so if that's doing that, let's do more of this building. Construction complete. Thanks. And then we'll build a couple of these. Construction complete. Construction complete. 
construction complete. Great. Um, right, so yeah, we. Uh, I don't know how much money these things cost because I wasn't paying a lot of attention. Um, when can we put a new? Um, we can get one of those for sure. So let's build that. Let's build that here. Yay! Okay, cash injection coming. Excellent. Alright, so we can probably get work underway on the uh, spice refinery. I love how that looks like eyeballs on stalks there. That, that could be a, a, a different uh, different flavour of game, couldn't it? Yeah, there we go. Build one of those. Because that's right on a little sea of... spice there so we should be fine from that point of view we go yeah so I mean hopefully that should just start yeah harvesting straight away brilliant um, and then we could venture over here a bit but then we're perhaps drawing risking drawing more of the attention of um, oh okay we are kind of in need of some more power so we could put a new power thing there uh power power thing there we go wind trap power center i mean while we're wreaking environmental devastation it's quite nice that it's like a renewable source of energy isn't it Brilliant. So now, yeah, now we're well equipped for that. So this starport, I mean, I, I kind of want a starport because it's there and it looks exciting. Um, so it costs 500. I can't do that just yet. Um, and its footing is three by three. So we can do that. Let's start getting some more concrete down at the very least. Brilliant. And then we'll get the these going. Oh, I'm assuming that harvester went off somewhere. Where did it go? Oh, you. Okay. Yes, sir. Harvester down here, please. We don't want to go too far north now, do we? Uh, right. D can I have another one of these? Okay, yeah, we have to wait for our ship to come in, but when it does, um, we can hopefully get a starport down here, which will be rather exciting. Um, I'd kind of like the heavy to get heavy vehicles as well. Heavy vehicles would be nice. Um, I'm going to have a little look. What does it cost to get a wall? 50 per square of wall. We, so we could get one square of wall. I Mind you, how much does it cost? Yeah, we can. Right. We'll start off getting a couple of squares of wall. Or, I guess, if we just sort of concrete a little bit around here that might be quite handy actually oh uh, so we're, we've suddenly got lots of money again so let's build it it's 500 
<gasps> Starport facility. I'm a little bit excited, you know. I wonder what's going to happen. Right, that one's doing fine. How's this one doing? Is it on its way back? Okay, now we're now we're really getting somewhere. Um, okay. Starport. The starport is used to order and receive shipments from Chom. Right. Does that um, does that mean then that that frigate in orbit and awaiting order? Oh my goodness. Okay, a rocket launcher, a combat tank. Mobile construction vehicle. Oh, so this is how we get our heavy vehicles then. Um, a spice harvester. An all-purpose carry-all. Heavy attack quad. Light attack trike. Do we not have the uh, invoice? Interesting. Um, do we not have the heavy tank like they have? I mean, a rocket launcher would be good. Should we get a rocket launcher? It costs 405. Yeah, let's get a rocket launcher. No units on order. Oh, okay. Do I need to go? Oh, okay. Send order. Okay, so I'm assuming that at some point... Oh, frigate arrival in T-8. Yeah, so at some point that will just kind of appear out of the heavens is is my impression interesting that's a different way of doing it um intriguing right so is there anything else unlocked in our chain of things here a factory not just yet okay um i think i should i'll probably unlock the Rocket turret. No, yeah, the rocket turret. Yeah, upgrade that. Oh, didn't mean to go shooting off there. We, um, what is harvester deploying? Good, we're doing right on the harvesting front, really, uh, at this point in time. That's nice. Frigate arrived. Frigate arrived. Yeah. Oh, oh, there it is. <gasps> nice, so it'll drop off our rocket launcher, presumably. Look at that beast, is that? Oh yeah, that's our equivalent, isn't it? Brilliant, okay. Well, you go over here, then. We could put, like, a front here, couldn't we? Yeah, so what if I do a, um, yeah, you guard there, thanks. Uh, right, so construction-wise, let's do a bit more of this. Um, and then we'll, watch, let's move you a little bit further out. Move you a little bit further out. Yes, sir. Move you a little bit further out. And then build with one of those. Oh, that could do with some orders. Go harvest over there, please. Let's place that there. Great. There we are. Um, yes, sir. Move, move, please. Acknowledged. Thanks. Yes, sir. And you can move there. Acknowledged. Yes, sir. You can move there. Acknowledged. Great. Great. Um, another one of those, please. Construction. Yes, sir. 
So if we, if we've got a hard limit on the on the number of yep. units we can have at any Check one time, I mean I should really just go for a load of rocket launchers, shouldn't I? Because they're going to be our best defense against things. How are we doing on power? Yeah, we're we're getting there. Um, I will do another power. Uh, wind power generator plant uh, to go here in this spot and I think I'd, I probably don't need all of these this concrete actually it depends what I want to do um, yes, sir. I'm going to move you down there, yes, sir. move you a little bit further up there, thanks, yep, thanks, yes, sir. move you a little bit further up too, I'm going to move yes, you a little bit further up, good, um, because I think what I'll do is I'll start putting in some wall, Don't do that. Construction complete. Brilliant. I'm gonna put a wall along here. Uh, I think I'm gonna have like a little perimeter wall around here. Uh, funds permitting, obviously. Construction. To try and prevent people getting to my construction site with any um, any ease, and we can go from there. Construction complete. Lovely. Um, right, so we are refilling, so we can put some more concrete down complete. here. Construction complete. Here. Right, you. Uh, you're obviously a little confused about where the spice is, but. I'll help you out a bit there. Um, another one of these, please. Construction complete. All right. We're going to spend a little time doing this, I think. Complete. Enemy unit approaching. Uh oh, that's oh, that's not good. Complete. Okay. Yes, sir. That's it's not encouraging their founders. I mean, they were airdropped in, so maybe that's not so much of a problem. I don't know. Oh. Okay. Well, our rocket launch is not doing very well. That doesn't bode well. Right. Uh, no. Is this one of their tough ones? No, it's just a regular tank. So we should be able to deal with this. Troopers. Troopers, troopers. Infantry. What's the difference between troopers and infantry? All right, well, this isn't going great, uh, I must say. Okay, so we got some reinforcements though, that's good. Right, uh, I was just trying to build a wall, you know? All right, we're nearly there. 
I'm not very pleased that our, our one rocket launcher got so uh, quickly uh, destroyed because I was hoping that would be a pretty tough um, tough target but apparently that's not the case Well, very disappointing. Let's hope they don't follow that up with any further. Attempts to attack us because that would be unfortunate. Very unfortunate. Okay. And hopefully no Sardalka because that would just be be taking the Mickey, wouldn't it? Right, okay, let's get back on the wall. Building. We've got a decent amount of money. Um, are we still harvesting? We're still harvesting there. Um, we might still need to look further south for more sources on the left hand side, but there's still plenty of room on the right for harvesting. Right, we could get another harvester going yeah we're doing well on the energy front as well so that could only help place that there I suppose at the moment we might be running out of storage space. Yeah. Um, so that's something to bear in mind, isn't it? Should we, hang on, let's pause a minute and build this. Construction complete. Let's get another silo in here. Silo is that one isn't it there we go yeah complete. uh right so place that there so that should uh help out with that concern for now um back on the wall Uh, soon I'm gonna have more wall than Pink Floyd, which would be would be fun. I think wasn't there one version of the um one possible iteration of the of the Dune movie that would have had music by Pink Floyd? Or perhaps that's too on the nose. I can't remember. Okay, we're getting there. Construction complete. Right, you need to harvest. There's loads, there's loads of spice down there. Go down there. Construction complete. Okay, so I think the attack was an isolated attack because there hasn't been a follow-up wave. So that's uh, mildly encouraging to me. That we might still have a have a hope here. Construction complete. Construction complete. Construction. I think you can see what I'm going for now. 
Um, something to just kind of deter anyone who, you know, might consider rolling by to start bombarding any of my facilities. Because that wouldn't be, wouldn't be very nice. So I think what would be good is probably to have um, some gun emplacements in this general vicinity. So I think I might actually let's get one more block of concrete. Oh, we're gonna need to put concrete down anyway, so let's get building them. I was hoping by leaving this gap is to have like a runway for vehicles to get around because I I kind of forgotten about that in the general plan of this area, um, but that does seem to help with um, with general mobility and accessibility for getting. Th uh oh. What's that blue flyer doing here? Okay, there might be something might be something going on soon. Um, right, I'm going to put uh, one there. Uh, one there. One there. Uh, yes, if you sir. folks Acknowledge. don't mind moving over there, thank you. Um, we will put another one there. Construction complete. Might as well put one somewhere yes, in the sir. middle as well. Acknowledge. Construction complete. That's good. Um, I suppose... Hmm, I suppose that'll do. Yeah, we'll go with that. So, in theory, that's five of the rocket ones. They're 250 each, so they're, they're not cheap, are they? But hopefully they should be effective. Right, this harvester, what? It's hoovering up the last of those bits. So I have to send it off to Scout for another source soon I think if you want to exploit this um, left hand area okay quite slow to construct I think there's probably a good place rocket turret the rocket slash cannon turret is used for both short and medium range active defense okay that sounds fine to me Oh, where are you off to? Yes, sir. If you're going north, I Acknowledge. wouldn't recommend it. Go south. Okay. I think for um, for this session of play, I'd kind of like to get the base fleshed out a little bit. Um, we might leave it at that point. Because we're, um, we're in a stable position right now. Which um, I'm happy. Uh oh. Right. Well, everybody attack this thing because it's. Uh, no, hang on. I think they might already be attacking, but. Wow, it's. it's Okay, you know, we are taking it out, so that's... it's working. Um, a repair unit might be good, might it, for our vehicles? Um, if I can find that. I don't know if that would be a possibility, actually, because it didn't seem to be in the menu. But let's have a little look. Um, so that's a rocket launcher, that's a combat tank, that's a mobile construction vehicle. That's a spice harvester. That's all purpose carry all. Um, heavy attack quad, light attack trike, and that's that's 
it, isn't it? Interesting. Uh, resume the game. Uh, can we... I think we might just do light vehicle factory to see what that unlocks. Because I can't recall what happened before. I don't know for certain whether what happened before would happen again. Um, is my storage capacity low? Oh no. Okay. Well, another one over here then, I guess. I was just contemplating getting another harvester as well, but if we're um, already kind of at our, uh, our max, then that wouldn't necessarily make any sense. It'd be nice if the spaceport could actually take some of this spice away, so we'd have to worry about storage so much. That would be that'd be handy. Well, I'll let that one keep going. It might come back with less than. Uh, yes, sir. Less than a full tank of spice, but that would be all right. Hang on, where, where did we get siege tanks from? I don't recall having siege yes, tanks. Did they get airdropped in while I wasn't paying attention? I mean, I'd, I'm happy. It'd be nice if I could build them as well. That would be wonderful. Right, I was building something, wasn't I? I was building uh, I, this. This. There we go. Okay, cool. Yes, so I want you to move down to the. S How about the middle yeah. south? That should be safe-ish. And um, in the meantime, more guns because they were pretty useful actually, or at least against one uh, heavy-duty tank. Uh, but I think with multiple ones, it should only improve our chances. And we still got the credits, so no worries there. All right, there wasn't anything yes, there, sir. so if you just move along into the far Take corner there, we should hopefully run into some more spice and no spice worms, because that would be um, less than favourable. Okay. The old power has gone out. Uh, if I repair them, we might just get back to what we need. Yes, okay. So we could do with more more power generation. That's fine. Um, I'll do that as my next thing. I'm going to leave a little gap in the middle here. So I will need a... Um, one of these is a spacer. Construction complete. There, thanks. And then I will build this. Construction complete. Oh, has it found? Oh, it's found a little bit, hasn't it? Yes, right. Sir. You start harvesting that. You shouldn't go too far astray, I don't think. Right, yes, and then sir. you keep harvesting over here because there's still stuff here. Great. Um, and then I get to place this here. Sure, why not? Um, and in it, this place, I get to put a power station. Build this. Thank you. Construction complete. So I'm not uh, thinking about mobile construction and a new 
construction site. Um, I'm not quite sure where I would put it. I guess I need to know where there's perhaps more of a likely staging post, really, for that sort of thing. So we could, when we're ready to go on the offensive, we could um, then go and, um, and try and take on one of the bases. But it certainly wouldn't behoove us to take both all at the same time. That I can only imagine that would be a disaster. So it would be good to build up some forces. I'm going to sneak in another little turret there, I think. Just so we've got a pretty good coverage around a few angles. At least from the, uh, the north, um, east and west. We go. Lovely. So we've got a we've got a fair bit of building space, which is is quite nice. Um, power in terms of power. We're I mean we're not overflowing, are we? So. Hmm. Um. In terms of spice storage, we're doing okay. We're doing okay at the moment. Right, let's get more power going so that we shouldn't have to worry about that for a while. Yes, here we go. And then I'll pop another thing in here. Um, so we've got a little bit more uh, left and right travel room there. Um, and then a uh, block of four. Yeah, yeah, this is going okay, I think. Um. Yes, yeah, so I think when we look at the silos, the holds is like what's currently in there, and its max is 1,000. So kind of 60% full across the board, which is good. And we're kind of using 60% of our power. So yeah we are doing all right so this one um i yeah i guess it's probably better actually to send it back over here at the moment because the other spice is further away and i guess it's not risking getting into trade's territory too quickly but still Uh, we were in the meantime building this, weren't we? Where are we going to put it? I'm not sure I'd quite work that out. Um, I was thinking there, but then that's not quite right, is it? And it could go there. Is that good enough? We could put something directly next to one of these, or offset it slightly. But then it blocks that. Hmm. Well, the oh, let's nestle it in there. There's nobody else is getting in there, are they? That's fine. Right. So this was going to be for. Uh, well, let's see. I kind of assumed the light vehicle factory took four. It does. Okay.
construction complete. Okay. We place that there. So, well, let's upgrade it. Why not? I love an upgrade. So, what can you build here? The heavy attack quad and the fast raider trike. Okay, cool. Um, interesting. And then, does it has that? Oh, it has unlocked better things. So we've got the high tech factory, the heavy vehicle factory. I feel like the high tech factory is the one to go for, isn't it? Have you seen that before? I do like the image. That requires six. Interesting. Costs 500. We can definitely afford it. Repair facility. That was what I wanted. I recall. So let's see if we can get that going as well. That needs a space of six. That could nestle in there quite nicely, couldn't it? Let's do that. Um, Construction complete. Do we? Uh, my question is: Do we automatically get the plane that picks stuff up for repairs, or do we need to buy that separately? Because I think we can get that through the um, the mail order catalog. The space Argos, if you will. Okay. Right, so this was going to be the repair facility. Because at the moment, we're not pumping out a lot of um, a lot of units. And when we do, I kind of like them to be... Yes, sir. Uh, no, I don't want to do that. I want to harvest over there. Kind of like them to be the most useful of units, um, if possible. Nice. Brilliant. Um, I don't know. Oh, it needs repair itself. Oh, the, uh, the attrition of... Yes. So if there's something yes, that's damaged, like yes, that one, can that move to here and repair itself? Is that how that works? We'll see. We'll see what happens. I'm curious. Uh, on the power front, we're still doing alright. On the silo front, we're still doing alright. Brilliant. Right, it's going to take a while navigating there. <laughs> um, it's probably, we probably wouldn't have chosen to come around this way, but yeah, there's, yeah you're not going to be able to get through there. You're going to need to come around all the way around here. Yep, around this one. And then you can get through this gap here. That's the gap I've left for you. Aren't I generous? Oh, you can go diagonally. Well, what do I know? Ah, oh, yes, if you manually direct them. They do it. Interesting. Interesting. Let's get the... Yes, nice. Um, let's get the plane in by mail order so that I don't have to do that manually because I will forget. Um, all purpose carry all that's what we want to do one of those please uh, let's send the order should we get another hub nah, nah that's, that's fine I guess yeah the benefit of multiple things in one order is that they will all arrive at the same time uh, but at the moment we're not really pushed for time so I'm not too worried what I am thinking about is maybe more turrets I t no no you know what I'm going to Resist the urge for more turrets. And I'm going to get that factory, the high-tech factory. That's what we're going to do. And it all starts with concrete, my friend. It all starts with concrete. Here we go. Frigate arrived. Oh, that was quick. Construction. 
Right, so that, as far as I'm aware, is just sort of autonomous and will whiz around doing stuff. Yes, sir. Um, no, uh, harvest, please. Down here. That one's still yes, there. Oh, it's going to be picked up. Ah, oh, yeah, yeah. That's good. Oh, it's got my screen's gone blank. That's interesting. I've never seen that before, I don't think. There we go. We're back. Um, this is lovely. I have built that. Let's get the high tech thing going. So that's this one. And I'll remind myself if I have known before what the high tech factory gives us. I'm assuming there's duplication between the light vehicle factory, the heavy vehicle factory, and the um, the high tech factory, with uh, all the things you can mail order in. This is perhaps just a one stop shop for getting those things in that you can use an alternative. That's what I'm thinking. Right, I'm assuming our power burden is going to be higher. It is, it's getting closer to um, to being an issue, for sure. Um, what about our spice? We're still doing alright on spice. I don't know, I still don't know if the game um, does ship any stuff out at any point or not. Right, that is constructed, right? Let's see. Oh, it's already damaged. Um, let's see what we can build. Oh, an all-purpose carry-all. Is that what you can get? Interesting. Well, you know what? That was a way of finding that out, wasn't it? Okay. Let's pop... Um, so, yeah. So, I think this essentially um, negates the need for the other factories. Which is is interesting. Should I get some rocket launchers? I feel like that would be good. And what if I get a combat? Can I get a siege tank? Should I? Should I get a? Okay, I'm gonna do an experimental. Let's see what happens if we build a heavy vehicle factory, and see what that can generate for us because I'm interested and those two are over there yes, sir. chugging away yes, sir. lovely right let's place this uh, another spacer please and then we will go up here so does the uh, what f uh, footprint does the heavy vehicle needs a Rectangle, okay, that's fine. So let's build this. I mean, I'm kind of impressed at the um, oh, interesting the size of a uh, base we've been able to build relatively unhindered, but I'm also quietly worried about what's going on that we don't know about with the Atreides. That could be an issue because I haven't really been building up my my forces. I feel like so if we have to make a strike, and we will have to make a strike against one of the bases, I think the one on the left top left corner is probably the one to go for because it seemed, at least from the quick recce we did earlier, to be the smaller of the two. So I'll contemplate that. Let's, let's upgrade it. Always upgrade. Okay, lovely. I, I will. Hmm, what will I? Right. Let's see. I, you can upgrade again. Yeah, sure. Always upgrade. Okay. What can it do? It can do heavy siege tank. Oh, okay, they're good. Combat tank, mobile construction vehicle, and spice harvester. 
Oh, do they have different costs to the... So that's like 300 and 900 to get them there. What do they cost from the spaceport? That could be another issue, couldn't it? Um, ah, 450. Oh, oh, that's more expensive, but that's cheaper. Oh, that's interesting. Um, but that's the only place that we can get the siege tank, which is, I think, going to be I think a combination of siege tanks and the uh, rocket launchers are probably going to be the ones to go for because they're going to do big damage but probably not survive very long but the siege tanks will probably do small amounts of damage and be quite hardy interesting okay and this all purpose carol is 999 which i think could be any more expensive but uh the one we construct is probably cheaper right yeah okay so i want to get my um I want to get my mobile construction. Oh, hang on. Oh, does it? F this is nine hundred ninety now. Did that? Was that not cheaper earlier? Did I misread it? Yeah. So it is cheaper to build your own in as a as a general rule. Okay. Um. Yeah, but I can't get a rocket launcher from anywhere else. Interesting. Interesting. Well, I will. Get a couple of rocket launchers then. I think if we're going to start stocking up now. Two. Yeah, all right. And then we can get this one to get us a couple of siege tanks, please. Yeah, so I think I'm going to start massing on this side for an assault over there at some point. Um, how are the harvesters doing? Okay, I think. Where's, oh, yeah, just got yes, dropped sir. off. Nice. Yes, sir. Lovely. How are we doing, like, damage yes, and repairs? Yeah, so we're not. Yes, sir. Things aren't. Yes, sir. Uh, repairing themselves at the moment, which is interesting. How are we doing? Power is getting close. Storage is is fine actually. So we could do with more power. We put another power station there. Actually, that would be fine. Um, money isn't coming in as quickly as it was, so that's uh, interesting to note. Uh, so, let's get another one of these. Wind trap power centers last thing on the list get all of those um i feel like we've so we i've built most of the technologies right how about if we get the infantry as well complete. and just see what we can do with that i think that would i think that would work okay so that requires that is uh that one is there that requires just a block of four concrete so we can build that i'm going to pop that on the end there Construction complete. there we go and then while that's doing that this should be doing another one of these really if we can afford it Right, that was the 
this one. Okay, brilliant. Right, you move over here. Right, three siege tanks is a good start, I think. There should be a um, a rocket launcher somewhere, shouldn't there? I've got a random. Yes, sir. Oh, you're tr you you spent all your time just trying to work out how to get to the repair center. That's fine. Yeah, what happened to our? Yes, sir. Oh, the launcher. Yes, sir. Oh yeah, yeah, there they are. Yes, okay. Right, I'm moving these over here too. They should probably go behind the uh, the siege tanks. Although you can't really control the speed yes, at which uh, things move on their their given path, so might not be the best thing. Right, I wonder if it's worth then setting up a... Hmm, it might be worth scoping out what's over there in a bit more detail. I'm thinking. We're not getting a lot of money in from Spice anymore. Yes, sir. They say they don't even bother to head back anymore. Alright. We're doing okay, but we don't have a, a load of money coming in. So I am thinking maybe if we get a harvester from this one. Uh, is this? Yeah, there we go. Excellent. Right. Yes, so if I get that to harvest over there, that's another source of income for the moment. Is that thing going? Um, but yeah, let's get one of the little scooty bike things. One of yes, these sir. to just kind of whiz down and have a look at this area that we haven't explored yet. Because it'd be handy to know where the land masses are and where the spice deposits are. Um, yeah, they go very slow. I've forgotten how slow they move. Right, yes, you sir. can harvest over there. We're kind of getting to the limit of what we can do in that area, aren't we? So, yeah, we might need to move operations to another spice resource, possibly. Because I don't want to trigger the wrath of that base um, before I'm ready. So yeah, maybe we'll concentrate our efforts on the the left hand side of the map. Yes, sir. Acknowledge. So it's pretty good little bit of concrete here. concrete uh, of natural rock formation which we can then concrete to build things so that that should be um, I mean that could be useful well mm, I wonder what how far this bit extends up here let's just have a little cautious uh, scoot up here I guess what would be really handy is if um if there's a rock outcropping that carries on all the way ah like here yes because that could be a good staging post as well yeah okay i'm f i'm perhaps feeling this Okay, so it's not so far from where we are as well. Interesting. Um, let's just uncover this bit. I wonder if it connects. Right, there's not a lot of spice over in that area actually, so we might have to think carefully about 
what we spend our money on from this point. Because I've, I've been a little profligate, I would say, um, and built everything that I could get my hands on. But you know, sometimes that's just how it goes. Okay, yeah, so I feel like if we are going to have a staging post, this is probably just about far enough away from everything that we could get away with it being here. Nice, okay. Cool. Oh, and there's, okay, there's some heavier rock outcroppings there which would help make it defensible. Nice, I like it. Um, right, so you, little one, yes, sir. you go tuck yourself away over there, please. Alright, how are our harvesters doing? 98%, yes, uh, 87%, yes, that's pretty good. Uh, you're gone, so are you here somewhere? Oh, you're soon to be, that's fine. Right, I feel like we should probably, at this point, um, get one of uh, the, you know, is this where you can get one of these? It is. Yeah, we get one of these while we can afford one. Yes, sir. Okay, you're, you're sorting yourself out, that's good. Can you turn through that? You can. Brilliant. Well done. Construction complete. Great. Okay. Well, I'm going to just move that there for a minute. Don't click deploy. Don't click deploy. Great. So that's safe on a bit of rock. And I think we'll, we'll save it there. And we're going to see what we can get to happen next. Um, in our next play session. Thank you very much for joining me uh, if you've been along for the entire ride. I hope uh, this has been an enjoyable time and I'll see you again soon for some more Dune 2. Oh no! Okay, well I was saying that but then where did the... Where's the enemy unit? Where is it? Up here? What? 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 How come I can see this spot? What's happening? Uh oh. Um, maybe it's all gone wrong. I am going to save. Uh. And we'll leave that as a cliffhanger for next time. Right, sixth. Uh oh. Maybe. It's all gone wrong. Yeah, because if they found us before we're ready, we might be in some trouble. But we're not, eh, we're probably not in the worst, worst state. Um, oh, I think it is saving. Is it saving? Do I need to insert my save disk? I think we're okay. What happened to that thing? It disappeared from view. That, oh no, no it's back. Okay, well, uh, yep, right, because it's a rocket launcher, it can kind of fire things from a f further distance. Well, you know, we'll, we'll see what that's all about next time. Uh, thank you very much for joining me. Uh, take care and make sure you dodge all rockets. That's my advice to you. Bye-bye.